Hello fans, it's Blake with Channel Android and today I'm going to do a quick video on obtaining root on our brand new device here, the Motorola Droid Bionic. First off, let's just get a little little bit out of the way here. If you choose to do this, I am not responsible for it. You could damage your device in the process and you could void the warranty. So, if anything happens bad, it's on you, not on me. And a quick thank you to the fine folks at Roots Wiki who have put in the effort on being able to do this. They're smarter than I am, and if it weren't for them, I wouldn't be sitting here recording this video. Also, they're not responsible. So, let's get to the fun. You'll want to go to RootsWiki.com and download the file. I will provide a link um, with this video where you can go and download it, or you can just go over to Roots Wiki and look around in the Droid 3 forums. This isn't the Droid 3 forums, but it is supposed to work on the Droid Bionic. Hopefully when this video is done, it will not be a video of me breaking my device. Once you've downloaded the file, it's a zip file. It's called droid underscore easy underscore root underscore v7d dot zip. So it is a zip file, and pardon my bumping the camera. Um, you want to place it somewhere nice and convenient. I put it on my desktop. Here you can see the zip file. Um, and I'm doing this on a Mac, by the way. I'm doing this root on a Mac. So the instructions are similar on a Windows machine, but this is Mac specific. Okay, so you'll double click that file and it will, wherever you have it, it will end up with a folder that is the unzipped version of the zip and what I did was I went ahead and opened up the folder and moved all the files onto my desktop I think that's if you don't have a lot of stuff on your desktop and I keep nothing on my desktop that is the easiest way in my opinion okay first off you've got your phone you are going to want to make sure that you are in USB debugging so what you're going to do is you're going to go to menu. I said menu. Thank you. Settings, applications, development. And then right there where it says USB debugging, make sure that that box is checked. And you also want to slide down on the notification bar, click on where it says USB connection. It says that because I'm already plugged in. If you're not plugged in, it won't say that. So once you're plugged in, just pull that up. Make sure that you have it on charge only. Okay, click the OK button. I'm going to sit this down. Now, I've already got all the files on my desktop. Here is my terminal. You're going to want to open up terminal. If you're not too familiar with terminal on your Mac, open up applications folder and then go to the utilities folder. We want to change our directory to the desktop since that's where the files are stored. Let me move this down into the camera a little bit. So we're going to do CD desktop, hit enter. And then once you have done that, you're going to type SH, and then you're going to type the name of this run to root your droid, .sh file. It's a shell file. So uh, I'm going to type this real quick. Run to root your droid3.sh we hit enter give it a moment a moment and you'll see make sure you make the pre meet the prerequisites install the correct driver uh, USD debugging plug in your phone whatever you should be ready to go if you've done what I've told you to do thus far press enter to continue so let's hit enter and wait for the magic to happen it says it's rebooting the phone when the uh, phone is done rebooting you may want to unlock it so we're just gonna wait
All right, let's unlock and set it back down. Demon started successfully. phone is rebooting right now. I don't guess I need to hold it up for you to see the reboot process. Essentially you're just going to do this. It doesn't, instructions from a Roots Wiki do not say exactly how many times this is going to happen, but basically it's going to reboot again and we're going to unlock it just like we did before. It says running exploit part two of three, so Maybe, just maybe, this is going to be over soon. All right, let's see what the phone is doing. Remount succeeded. Success, all done. Your phone should be rooted. So, there you have it. I should be able to open up here. And there we have super user. So, Droid Bionic, root obtained, success. Have a nice day. Thanks again to the folks at RootsWiki, and be sure to check out our blog at channelandroid.com.